Well, hey all, how's it going there? Uh, we just watched the new episode of Beavis and Butthead. You know, uh, the first one that's practically, that's been ever been broadcasted in practically in 14 years. And, you know, we're about to share our thoughts with you about it. Now, so, I don't know, it's funny, it's been 14 years since fucking Beavis and Butthead have been around. I mean, last time I heard they were dead, but obviously that's not the case anymore and everything like that. And this, I don't know, I mean, like... Robert, they were never dead. I know. Robert has been I've had episodes where they should have been dead. Even in the movie, they should have been dead. Alright. You know? True. You know? So they can never die. You no, know? but, um... They can never die. You know? I don't know, but with this new recent episode and this whole new reboot and everything like that, to tell you the truth, I mean, I don't know, I'm a little skeptical because to tell Because, I don't know, I mean, like, as much as I liked it or whatever, there actually... There was one... There was a couple of things I kind of had a few itches about it. Okay. And, um, but number one, but the things that I liked, though. I liked how they recycled a bunch of animation, for yeah. fucking what you call it, for the commentaries. And you know, and it's kind of the funniest with the commentaries. I mean, I never fucking liked them as a kid, but these ones right now, because now since I'm older and everything like that, they actually are kind of funny. The fa- you know, and it's, and it's weird that freaking what you call it, I mean, I thought they, I thought they were only going to do reality shows, but thank God they're still doing music videos. God knows I've never heard of those music videos nor those bands before. Yeah, but you gotta really, really realize the the music that is in now. It was mm-hmm. still when they did it fourteen years ago. You know, Beavis and the Butthead did. The, you know, they were like, you know, they would take a video like Snoop Dogg. You know, God knows people don't like Snoop Dogg back then, or like you know, or bands like mm-hmm. Danzig or Corn or like yeah. Pantera. <laughs> you know, certain people did didn't know about them, but they still did it. As of now, certain people don't know who like you know these guys are. But, you know, hey, what can he do? Yeah, the, the goddamn, hey, I don't know. I mean, obviously you can tell that a lot of uh, a lot of that animation and a lot of that, that script order was kind of, uh, I think it might it might be, you know, it's obviously made for a new audience. You know, these tween porn faggots. I guess so, you know. Uh, yeah. you, you know, know you know what, you know what crowd I'm talking about, the tween, the tween pop audience or whatever they're called. <laughs> no, but yeah, it's like, I mean, I, I mean, I think it was cool. I mean, I thought I was going to dread the whole thing where they were going to fucking talk about reality shows because God knows anybody who knows me, I hate MTV reality shows. I mean, that's what kills MTV for me and everything like that. I mean, hell, I mean, I didn't even want to watch the episodes on MTV. I'd rather just watch them on the internet, but I'm doing it for the ratings thing for them. They could show that people are watching this. Yeah, dude, it's, that's, it, what, it, yeah that's, it's, that's what I did. As soon as when I went like, oh shit, it's 10, flip to channel 67 or whatever channel you guys have it on. You probably have it on fucking demand or some shit. Yeah. But I flipped it 10 p.m. and I fucking loved it, dude. Yeah, we had to do that obviously for the ratings, not like other ones who just don't tolerate fucking seeing MTV bullshit because I don't want to fucking see what, uh, what else MTV has on their stupid shit. Well, you know, there's certain good shows. Not not all, but there's certain good ones. But not all. But, you know, that's just yeah, like, my... Yeah, d- uh, like 20 years, like 15 years ago. Well, even now, <laughs> there's still sh- good shows. But, you know, mm-hmm. that's that's a different thing. But go on. But yeah, it's like, I don't know. I mean, I'm glad that they're doing uh, reality shows or whatever. Because at least, basically, as much as I don't like them, I mean, I swear to God, them doing Jersey Shore. Anybody who knows me, I hate Jersey Shore. I mean, I want to take a fucking chainsaw to Snooki's vagina and eviscerate her completely. <laughs> That's funny that you mention it, because uh, mm-hmm. Beavs and uh, Butthead, they were on Jimmy Kimmel a few nights ago, live. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, and then... Um, like you were on David Letterman ten year, uh, 20 years ago? Yeah, but the, <laughs> oh, but, but but this time it was Snooki. She was a special guest. Jimmy Kimmel said, okay, well, since, you know, Judge J- J- Shore is over, what are, what are you going to do? She said, I'm going to go home, chill, and watch the new Beavis and Butthead. Oh, God. As soon as when, <laughs> when she said that, Beavis and Butthead came out in, in, in their own world watching the Jimmy Kimmel show. Talking shit about how Snooki wants to wow, well, watch this shit. And then what shit my mind was that Jimmy Kimmel said, Wait, hold, hold on, hold on. He looks at the fourth wall, staring at Beavis and Butthead, and he comes into their world. Oh, he goes God. into their world. Oh, God. An animated Jimmy Kimmel. Well, uh, uh, real life, but he goes into their world. Oh, God. And then, like, he tells them, Go. Go to my show and then see how hard it, it, it really is. So, so he's in his un, like in his fucking boxers, he, <laughs> eating na- eating fucking nachos. <laughs> and then the next clip it says, "Welcome to the Butthead Show." <laughs> While Butthead is Jimmy Kimmel, and then freaking Beavis 
is fucking the camera guy. <laughs> you gotta watch that clip. I'll, I'll fucking right. send it to you. Well, I, I well, was from well, a few well, night, night, nights ago. Well, look for, it. We'll look for it after this. Yeah, dude, it's fucking funny. But, yeah, dude, it's, it's like, you know... But, yeah, though, it's like, I don't know. To tell you the truth, I, um, with those two episodes... I actually I like the Twilight episode better. See, I like the crying one better, better. a little bit more. They're, uh-huh. they're both good, but you know, I don't know. The crying one to me, it felt pretentious. What, what do you mean pre- pretentious? It went pretentious because I mean it was constantly the same joke in almost like in every piece of animation that was in or whatever. I mean, God knows it has a great pay- it has a great payoff and everything. Like that. <laughs> but that's what makes it funny. Is it, that- had a, it had a great <laughs> payoff. But I was just funny. But I was just looking at it, and just all this and that, and it's going to go to my next point of basically, it's like, one thing that I really, one thing that I have to complain about this whole thing is that Beavis, to me, felt off. Wait, 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 off. Like, Beavis, to me, what? felt off. Like, there were, I mean, obviously, I, I'm not talking about the voice, because I knew all of that a long time ago or whatever, and, you know, everybody's That's just, gone, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's whatever. Bring in what you but no, Beavis felt off to me, because you want to know why, if you kind of notice, he didn't say chicks throughout the whole episode. That was one thing that really bothered me, the fact that he didn't say chicks. When he's, like, getting up out of the couch and everything like that, he's not saying... He says, oh, let's go get some girls. I'm thinking, like, what? He's supposed to say chicks. Well, you gotta realize, they're in a new timer, dude. This is a new fucking... No, but Butthead was constantly saying chicks, if you notice. You yeah. know, and everything like that. I mean, God, uh, you know, and all this and that. But it was just, it was so bizarre, just, and it was so off to me to see freaking what you call it, Beavis, like, all this and that. And also, Beavis has gotten a little bit smarter. Dude, that's, that dude, was really you gotta realize it's it takes fourteen years later, dude. You know they're, they're still the same age. They're, they're still like in modern, dude, dude. It's been twenty years. Simpsons are the same age. Don't fucking complain, dude. Mm-hmm. Simpsons are the same age. Bart has been ten since since nineteen eighty eight. You know, so don't fucking complain that they've been fourteen, fifteen year old kids for the past fourteen years. They should have been uh, twenty four by now. Not mm. four fourteen. So mm. you know they're in modern time, dude. You yeah, know, obviously, change, obviously, you know? obviously, they're sitting in the theater watching Twilight. Yeah, sadly, there are Martin change. I was actually almost tempted of asking, like, I wonder if they're, I wonder if that series is actually gonna like take off completely from the last episode. Is is McV- asking a very important question? Is McVicker dead? Ah, that's a good question. Is Nick good... Vicker dead? We gotta see the next episode <laughs> next Thursday. We gotta see. <laughs> You know, <laughs> is Nick Vicker dead? But yeah, to me, I don't know. It's just as Beavis just felt off. There was just, I mean, that's one of the thing. That's one of the reasons why I felt like the second episode was so pretentious because you know he, I mean, B- Beavis is actually basically saying like, "I'm not crying," and he's repeating it over and over again. Cause dude. he wasn't crying, dude. Man, dude. No, I mean, he was. Dude, dude, it was a tear. It was yeah. a tear. That's that official crying, dude. If I fucking, if I slam the door on on, on my thumb. And and if you saw me slam my door on my thumb and and, and if a tear came out, are are you gonna fucking tell me, dude, you're you're crying? Mm-hmm. I'm not crying. The fuck the fucking pain, the tear, you know? Yeah. It's it's I'm, I'm not crying. No, I know he wasn't crying. He obviously doesn't want to sound like a wuss. No, the bad no, wuss, dude. <laughs> the point wasn't that he wasn't crying. He wasn't lying. He wasn't crying. Yeah, yeah, but the thing yeah, is, I'm very is- sucky right now. Super hard. And if a cheer comes out, I'm, I'm not going to say, are you, are, you, are you crying? Dude, it's just one tear. <laughs> crying is like waterworks, like falls to the wall, fucking no, eyes to Sponge the floor. Is- SpongeBob is... SpongeBob's sad. It's more like he's drinking his own tears. <laughs> he's a sprinkler system out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But that's like, that's fucking loony shit. But yeah, dude. So, so... Dude, Beavis wasn't fucking lying, dude. You know? I, I know Beavis wasn't lying, but then, the, but one thing that goes off to basically of why I said he's a little off is because if you remember, like Beavis' pathology was always like basically, dude, the guy's always constantly angry, and the dude just always like wants to kick ass and everything like he that. He wasn't a kick ass, but I mean, he was, he but, was, but they yeah, kind of, but, uh, but but look what happened. Yeah, I know he got stopped by buzz cut, but. In my opinion, though, I think, like, you know, the old Beavis from 14 years ago would have just, like, freaking much got, he would have just said, like, butthead, shut up, or I'll kick your ass, I'll kick you in the nads. That's one thing that I really, that I miss, too, the fact that they didn't say that famous line, I'll kick you in the nads. You gotta realize, you know, it's the first episode, dude, you know, there's, uh, you know, there's certain vo- 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 vocabulary that they, that they, that they just can't say because... Anymore? Well, well, the thing is, they're they're, <laughs> they're probably too outdated, you know. Uh, you know no, like no one's no gonna one, say radical. No one's gonna say bogus. You know, 
Yeah, you know? I've never heard Beavis and Butthead say those terms. No, dude, I'm, I'm just saying that <laughs> like, from, like, from like a 90s point of view that like, you know, when you had TV shows, when they like said that, you know, yeah. you know you're not going to say them now. The last time I heard Bogus or, or Radical was fucking Bill and Ted, but it, that's a different story. That was like 20 years ago, man. Yeah, you know, yeah, oh, that's, a whole di- that's a whole different video to review. Yeah, man, dude, that's <laughs> almost 30 years ago. Like, <laughs> 1988, you know, 89, you know. So. Uh, I know, I figured so. I mean, there's certain words they obviously can't say. I mean, that and uh, something tells me, I think they hired another guy for Beavis, didn't they? Maybe that's why he wasn't saying chicks and stuff like that. Well, you gotta realize, you know, this is only the first episode, dude, you know. Uh-huh. I give it, like, I, I, I could ag- agree with you if it was, like, the whole fucking season already. He does not say chicks once. Yeah, you know, I, I will uh, uh, agree with you. He doesn't say, I'll kick you in the neck. Yeah, well, give it to the next episode. I'll, 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 I'll bet you, Q, Q will say it, you know. <laughs> Kick you in the uh, nads and right. like butt knocker and then you know, you know. But to me, they were, like they weren't bland episodes because I was watching early first season. Well, like not first season, but first volume mm-hmm. uh, episodes right before the new one came out. The first episodes when they're like mowing Tom Anderson's fucking lawn, <laughs> the one when he's like fucking cutting down their fucking the kids like his tree. To me, those are planned episodes. They're not funny, dude. It's breaking like, ah. Oh. Breaking the law. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, you know, those shows are, are, are cool, but their but their movement of, like, how they, like, like, the, like their body movement. You're talking about their delivery. Yeah, it's not funny. It's <laughs> not funny at <laughs> all. It, those episodes are fucking boring, dude. <laughs> They're fucking boring, dude, uh, you know? Uh, like, let alone, those were, like, probably one of the first a- a- episodes, you know? Paid its butt. <laughs> but, you know, and to me, they were just boring, dude. You know, I got the jokes. I mean, they develop later. Yeah, that's why, but, you know. This, this new season, honestly, I mean, because it's for a new audience and everything like that, it's going to have to take time to develop. I think I will, un- I kind of understand that now. I mean, well, I mean, obviously, that's with almost anything after fucking Witch Cup being, after coming back after 14 years. Oh, yeah, you know. You from know. what everything we've seen in the previews recently, I, I swear to God, it ain't nothing like fucking, like what we saw in the YouTube, uh, saw in the sneak peek YouTube video. Oh, yeah, man, sneak peek, yeah. yeah. You know, like, but I, 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 but I will admit, they might take advantage because since it's 14 years later, we live in, in, in a world that, like, that, like vocabulary is like more like modern they could they they could do more jokes and then make the impact more intense mm-hmm. on, on, on like 14 years ago where we're like okay there's a certain line that we can't cross mm-hmm. but now these lines could could be crossed because it's 14 we're more advanced we're more much like mature yeah maybe they can jack iPods certain. Yeah, well, yeah, and, then, like, throw, and then like most likely throw it away because like fucking it's got nothing but Lady Gaga and fucking Britney Spears on it. Oh so, yeah, no. but like I'm talking about like jokes about being gay or or like or, or like stuff like <laughs> like 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 that, you know, you know, <laughs> like you know, Family Guy does it all all the time. I, yeah. I don't know why fucking Be- Beavs and the Butthead can't, you know, yeah. but you know that's just me, you know. <laughs> Not that I can't gays, but you know, I'm just saying, right, you right, know. Right. <laughs> I don't know, but yeah, like I don't know. I still kind of say Beavis was a little bit off, and that was a little bit disappointing to me or whatever. But hopefully, which one call it? I don't know. Give maybe, it time. Give it time. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah, that's. Yeah. I don't know. They're still, I'm sure they're going to go up to like forty episodes. Hopefully, freaking much. Probably call it. thirty because I remember reading in, in a Rolling Stone magazine that um, Mike Mike did mm-hmm. thirty e- episodes. So probably those thirty will will, will probably be this season's. Oh. And then you know we'll see. You know. I, if they're good, we'll probably have another season. Right. You know, no more downloading. Well, to me, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna buy the fucking the volumes again. You know, <laughs> you know, we still gonna buy the other volumes. You know, fucking the v- the real bucks, man. Not like not like no offense to the Mike Judge collection. You know, volume one, two, and three, they're fucking awesome. Those are gold. But there's certain episodes that we want to watch that they were bad, and then some. We don't remember because, you know, they were too hardcore, you know? Mm-hmm. So we got to get the official, official, like, box hit if it even exists, you know? Mm-hmm. I, I, I bet it's not even out, you know? We got to collect them all, you know? Uh-huh. Ah, oh, man. Any last comments? I fucking loved it, man. You know, hopefully it's still as funny as fucking tonight's, you know? It was great to watch, to tell you the truth. I mean, to I loved, me, how, I loved how the animation, like, really, really changed or whatever. And obviously, it looks 
pristine now, basically. Oh yeah, you know, to it's me, super pristine. Yeah, to me, I I give this episode four out of five. You know, that's just me. I don't really give this episode that much of a rating, honestly. I mean, <laughs> yours gives it a two out of five. I mean. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. I mean, because it's it's really it's two episodes, not one. But yeah. Well, but yeah. That's, well, that's, that's but yeah, I don't know. The crying episode was very. It, to me, it, felt, it felt pretentious, but it, great payoff. Though. <laughs> but I liked it, man. Great payoff, though. Yeah. Well, I guess. Well, this is our vlog now, and I guess practically um, you're sick and tired of, uh, of hearing us, so we're done for now. And I don't know. Maybe we'll make more. Yeah, bye bye. Good night.